Hey Divi Nation, welcome to another special installment of our ongoing Divi Design Initiative. As a part of our Divi 4.0 release, we've been giving back to you, the Divi community, by providing you with six brand new Divi Theme Builder Packs, which are created by our design team, especially for you, and they are free right now. And today we are sharing with you the sixth Divi Theme Builder Pack, which is going to allow you to get a brand new design for your entire website up and running in just a few clicks. So if you aren't an Elegant Themes member, you will want to take advantage of our limited time 10% discount on memberships. For more information, check the video description below. So now let's go ahead and check out this sixth Divi Theme Builder Pack and how to use it. The sixth Theme Builder Pack is definitely colorful, elegant, and you can see that the global header here at the top is pretty unique with a combination of a centered primary menu and a left aligned secondary menu option here. And let's scroll down. This is our post template. You'll see the beautiful designs and the beautiful footer here at the bottom, with a colorful background, nice and simple and unique. Here's the product page template. the category page template or archive template, and the 404 page template. Now to get the sixth free theme builder pack up and running on your own Divi website, you'll first wanna to go to our blog post that features the theme builder pack, and then scroll down and find the download theme builder pack section where you'll find the email opt-in where you can enter your email address, then click the download button, there you will see the download the theme builder pack button appear. Go ahead and click it. Then you'll want to unzip the file. There you'll find all of the individual JSON files that will allow you to import the templates into your website. You're gonna to want to find the one that says all. Uh, this one will include all of the individual templates and allow you to import all of those onto your Divi theme at one time. Once the file's ready, you're ready to go to your WordPress dashboard. And there you'll need to navigate to the theme builder by going to Divi theme builder. And from the theme builder interface here, you want to go to the portability options by clicking the portability icon at the top right. Then from the portability modal pop-up, you'll want to click the import tab and then go ahead and choose that file. And there are some options for how you want to or whether or not you want to override the default website template or the existing assignments on your current theme. Uh, since we don't have any templates on this theme uh, currently, we can go ahead and leave those as they are and click Import Divi Theme Builder Templates. And just like that, we have all of our templates in place on our Divi theme. Make sure and click Save Changes so that those templates will be saved to your theme. Let's quickly check out what is included in this theme builder pack. You'll see the default website template has included a global header and a global footer. And you can edit any of these by clicking the edit icon. And this will bring up the global header layout inside the template layout editor here. And you can go ahead and use the Divi Builder to change the design however you like. Um, and then make sure and click your save button to save your changes before exiting the template layout editor by clicking the X icon at the top. The 404 page has a custom body template which can be edited as well. And there it is pulled up in our template layout editor here. The category page template is assigned to all category pages and it has our global header and global footer and you can customize the custom body template for the category page template. And as you can see, there's some dynamic content being pulled into your template here. And for example, this will be your post or archive title. This would be a blog module pulling in current pages posts. The post template includes the global header and footer. And let's go ahead and check out the custom body template for the post template. And in the post template, you can see all of this can be edited using the Divi Builder. And the post template is pulling in dynamic post content, like the title of the post, some, the date of the post, the author, comment count. Um, here is the post content module, which includes 
or pulls the, the current post's content. The product page template includes the global header and footer, and also the custom body template. And as you can see, this striking product page template really does make our product info stand out. And all of this, of course, is dynamic with our Woo modules. Let's go ahead and check out what some of our posts or pages will look like with our templates in place. Here's an example post pulling in the, the template design. Here's one of our products pulling in the template design. And of course, if I take a look on the back end to edit this product, you'll see that the Divi Builder isn't even being used. We're just using the standard WordPress editor to edit our product on the back end here. It's pulling in all that information dynamically. And here's our category page. Don't have very many posts in this example, but you can see how nice it looks. And of course our 404 page is in place as well when a user visits a page that doesn't exist on our website. All right, that's it for this video. Thanks for tuning in everyone. Please be sure to give a thumbs up if you like the video. And we sure do hope that you love this new Divi Theme Builder Pack. And of course, don't forget to subscribe to our blog newsletter, our YouTube channel, and like us on Facebook. That way you don't miss out on any future freebies we'll be throwing your way. Thanks again for watching. We look forward to seeing you in our next video.